2018 was another banner year for the New England Patriots. Bill Belichick, Tom Brady and company were able to win the franchise's sixth Super Bowl, tying them with the Pittsburgh Steelers for the most all-time. While it was a season that will go down in the record books, it's time to turn the page and refocus on the task at hand, winning a seventh Super Bowl in 2019. On Wednesday, the Patriots released a breakdown of the important date for this offseason as the team tries to put together another championship roster, mark your calendars, February February. 12. NFL clubs may begin to sign players whose 2019 CFL contracts have expired February 19, first day for clubs to designate franchise or transition players February 26 to March 4, combine timing and testing at Lucas Oil Stadium, Indianapolis, Indiana March March 5, prior to 4 p.m., New York time, deadline for clubs to designate franchise or transition players. Mar 11-13, during the period beginning at 12 noon, New York time, on March 11 and ending at 35959 p.m., New York time, on March 13, clubs are permitted to contact and enter into contract negotiations with the certified agents of players who will become unrestricted free agents upon the expiration of their 2018 player contracts at 4.00 p.m., New York time, on March 13. However, a contract cannot be executed with a new club until 4.00 p.m., New York time, on March 13. March 13, the 2019 league year and free agency period begin at 4 p.m., New York time, trading period for 2019 begins at 4.00 p.m., New York time, after expiration of all 2018 contracts. March 24-27, Annual League Meeting, Phoenix, Arizona. April April 1st, clubs that hired a new head coach after the end of the 2018 regular season may begin off-season workout programs. April 15th, clubs with returning head coaches may begin off-season workout programs. April 19th, deadline for restricted free agents to sign off our sheets. April 24th, deadline for prior club to exercise right of first refusal to restricted free agents. April 25-27, NFL Draft in Nashville, Tennessee, May May 3-6, clubs may elect to hold their one three-day post-draft rookie mini-camp from Friday through Sunday or Saturday through Monday. May 7th, deadline for prior club to send May 7th tender to its unsigned unrestricted free agents. May 10-13, clubs may elect to hold their one three-day post-draft rookie mini-camp from Friday through Sunday or Saturday through Monday. May 13, Rookie Football Development Programs Begin May 16-19, NFLPA Rookie Premier May 20-22, Spring League Meeting June-June 2nd, for any player removed from the club's roster or whose contract is assigned via waivers or trade on or after June 2nd, any unamortized signing bonus amounts for future years will be included fully in team salary at the start of the 2020 league year. June 3rd, deadline for prior club to send June 1st tender to its unsigned restricted free agents who received a qualifying offer for a right of first refusal only in order for such player to be subject to the CBA's June 15th tender provision. June 15th, deadline for club to withdraw qualifying offer to restricted free agents and still retain exclusive negotiating rights by substituting June 15th tender of one-year contract at 110% of the player's prior year paragraph 5 salary. June 16 to 30 rookie transition program to be held at individual clubs. July July 15, at 4 p.m., New York time, deadline for any club that designated a franchise player to sign such player to a multi-year contract or extension. After this date, the player may sign only a one-year contract with his prior club for the 2019 season. July 22, signing period ends for unrestricted free agents to whom a May 7 tender was made by prior club. After this date and until 4 p.m., New York time, on the Tuesday following the 10th weekend of the regular season, Prior Club has exclusive negotiating rights. Signing period ends for transition players with outstanding tenders. After this date and until 4 p.m., New York time, on the Tuesday following the 10th weekend of the regular season, Prior Club has exclusive negotiating rights. 
August August 1st, Hall of Fame game August 6th, deadline for players under contract to report to their clubs to earn an accrued season for free agency. If a drafted rookie has not signed with his club by this date, he cannot be traded to any other club in 2019, and may sign a player contract only with the drafting club until the day of the draft in the 2020 league year. August 31st, prior to 4 p.m., New York time, clubs must reduce rosters to a maximum of 53 players on the active, inactive list. September September 1st, claiming period for players placed on waivers at the final roster reduction will expire at 12 o'clock noon, New York time. Upon receipt of the personnel notice at approximately 1 p.m., New York time, clubs may establish a practice squad of 10 players. September 5th, at 12 a.m., New York time, the top 51 rule expires for all NFL clubs. September 5-8, regular season week 1 and we're on to 2019.